guys, it is Platinum. I'm just coming to share with you a quick haul. Went to Ross today, so I just want to share a couple of items I got from Ross today. Um, a loaf pan, purple, and the price on here was $2.99. And it's really sturdy. It's kind of long for a loaf pan. But I liked it because it was beautiful. I it. I love the price more than $2.99. Um, oh, I got this from Dollar General. Dollar oh. General. And it's Elf and it's a mirror. Normal size in the mag magnet. Oh, magnified. <laughs> Might be magnified on the other side. It was only a dollar. Um, Noise. This is a spoon holder, and it came with its own little cheesy wood spoon. I liked it because it was a chef face up top. And this was $3.99. And that's going to go right there. Because when I'm cooking, I hate placing the spoons or the fork on the stove because then I have to keep washing over and over. With that, all I have to do is wash that particular thing. Oh, I don't know if you all, this hair I did myself in singles. I did this actually going on two months old. I'm going to take it out and redo it in a sewing. Whether I'm going to do a tutorial on that or not, I don't know. But, um, yeah, anyway, back to the haul. This is a paper towel holder. It's black and it's real sturdy, durable. And this was $4.99. And as you can see, we need it. Um, for those of you that don't know, we moved to Georgia from up north, and we left all our lovely possessions, so we're starting all over again, so you see the videos and you hear echo in the house, that's why. Let's see what this was. Oh, uh, this was some bowls, I got this on Clarence, and we're doing the kitchen over in rainbow colors, which was consist of, you don't know the rainbow, it's right there. Went from purple, you know, to doing the multicolor. And these are the colors in here. There's actually four in here. Oh wow, it's two purples all around. And the price on here was let's see. Four ninety nine. Hand painted cereal bowls. Okay. And this smells so, so good. And it's called Juicy. And this was $3.99. Bath Therapy Fragrance Works. And you can use it for body wash, bubble bath, and shampoo. And it's no artificial color. This smells so scrumptious. Let's see, got a little cosmetics in here, not much. I'm not going to tell the price on these because I plan on them giving them away in a, um, in a giveaway. This is Elf, and there's three pigments in here. And this one is Glam Eye, and I thought this was so, so cute. Love the colors on here. And it's by Eyewear Collection. It's a good... Good eyeshadow for a smoky eye. And that's pretty it. Pretty much it. Like I said, it was a quick haul. I just wanted to share with you guys. I got a couple of emails and a couple of inquiries about when am I going to start doing cooking videos again. Uh, pretty much when I regain kitchen stuff back. I'm bad. And then we're trying to move again. So, <laughs> but hopefully I'm going to try to get something done. I don't know when. But I can show you something that I did get to help with the um, kitchen. Got this from a secondhand store called Chicken Soup. And I actually Chicken thought, Soup? thought it was a restaurant until my aunt took us there and showed us. As you can see, it has a drawer here. Um, this is the wine, where the wine would go. I guess it's for the wine glasses. Another drawer here. And if you go around, please, you go around to the side for me, please. I don't know how to lighten this. Let me turn my finger, man. And this one has a drawer here. 
and two drawers here, two shelves, and another drawer there. And it actually has a light electric outlet right there. And my baby says she's going to put some wheels on it for me so it can be mobile. And we was actually going to get one from Job. Oh, Big Lots? Big Lots. And it was $250. And it was nowhere near durable and sturdy as this was. And it was $250. And this was $80. And this piece here, we're going to end up using as a cutting board. The guy gave it to us, but we're going to buy either a granite top to go on or something to get fitted to actually go on out there. And that's pretty much it. As always, I hope everyone's having a blessed day. Um, I am going to be doing a, you already know, it's breast cancer month. So it's something coming real strong with that. You already know. I'm just trying to come up with some ideas as far as a contest or giveaway. So if y'all have any suggestions for a giveaway for a Breast Cancer Month, let me know, inbox me, PM, whatever. As always, keep it sexy. I hope everyone's having a blessed day. Peace.